Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I'm doing my week 22 update on the Chloe Tang challenge slash like just working out in general. I use Chloe Tang because that is the person I started out working with and following her workout plans or exercises, I should say. And then I do one other exercise by Alexis Wren. So like normal, I'm just gonna go through what I did this week, pretty much the same as last week. So if you wanna fast forward, you can. I'm just gonna run through this really fast. So Saturday, June 13th, I did not do anything. I took a day off. There's no excuses, honestly, so I'm just not even gonna talk about that. Sunday, June 14th, I did the 15 minute workout. I did the 11 abs, like the 11 line ab definition workout. I did the toned arm workout. That workout is about 10 minutes. I think mother stopped working out with me. I have no idea. She's had some weird schedule uh, hours with work and everything, or she just likes to sit on the couch. <laughs> then I did the hip dip workout. I really like this workout because I can feel different muscles working in my body and that's really cool. And then Monday, June 15th, I did the 2019 shred full body workout. Workout. This workout is the hardest for me. Actually, I'm feeling like it goes between the 30 minute workout and the 2019 full body shred. I don't know. It has to be like between those two. And then I did the Alexis Wren ab workout. I like this workout, but right at the end, I get so tired. And then I did the bra bulge. So it just like works your back muscles a little bit more, which I definitely need. And then Tuesday, like normal, I don't do anything. It is my off day, just in my regular routine. And then Wednesday, June 17th, I did the 15 minute full body workout and the Alexis Rin ab challenge video. I don't know if it's like a challenge or it's just her ab workout, so whatever. And then Friday today, June 19th, I did the 30 minute workout. I died, guys. I don't know why. Sometimes the 30 minute workout is like, really hard and then sometimes it's not as hard so it depends on the day I think and then I did the back workout the back fat the bra bulge workout and then I did the booty workout and this leads perfectly into the update section if you guys haven't seen my Chloe Ting resistance band review video I will link it on the screen in the cards but I got confused so now I'm actually on the medium resistance level I ended up jumping straight to the blue which is the hardest because I just didn't really pay attention so I used that one for a week but then I realized when I was making my review video that <laughs> The purple one is actually the medium. So I have been using the medium version, the medium level resistance this past week, and it's a lot better. And then as you guys know, food wise was not that good this week. Normally I'm pretty strict on like lower carbs, that sort of thing. But I will say I pigged out on Tuesday. You guys know teriyaki Tuesday is a thing um, in our house now ever since like the quarantine stuff started. We always have Panda Express on Tuesdays. Don't know really why, it just became a thing. And um, I always get the teriyaki chicken. So we call it teriyaki Tuesday. I know this sounds like first world problems, but I just think it's funny. So I wanted to share it with you. Panda Express, the one near our house, ran out of rice, like white steel steamed rice. I don't know. I think it's kind of funny. I don't know what you guys think, but let me know down below. They ran out of rice, right? So they had the teriyaki chicken and the guy was like, we ran out of white rice. So he said there was no white rice. And so my mom was like, oh, well we can wait till you can cook some, like it's fine. Cause you know, rice doesn't take that long to cook. And she asked, when will it be ready? And he said, tomorrow. And we were just like, what? So apparently they were like physically out of white rice. Very odd. So I just said to give me some more chicken. That was fine. And then obviously the sauce, the little packets of the teriyaki. So he fills up the entire bowl with chicken, which is amazing. I love their chicken, but gosh, that was a lot of food. And then luckily we have a payway near our house. So we just went to payway to get white rice. The two restaurants are pretty close together. Like it's not, we didn't have to drive a far ways away. Um, we finally get this like big bowl of like white rice and I come home and I eat way too much. I should have like saved some for like lunch the next day or something, but I decided to eat like a lot of it. So yeah, long story short, I ate a lot on Tuesday. And the last update for this week is I have been drinking a lot more water. I normally only drink water. That's like my drink of choice. I drink water, alcoholic beverages, so like uh, mixed drinks, wine, pretty much everything. I like to try a lot of alcoholic beverages. 
unlike other things i don't really like to try a lot of food but alcoholic beverages i like and i drink these mocha latte adkins shakes so i don't drink a lot of like soft drinks anymore or like juices i do like juices i love lemonade but i've kind of tried to stay away from that stuff but guys i got a new water bottle this is not sponsored this is not they did not give this to me i bought this with my own money and also bought this straw cleaner i got this health ish water bottle and i really love the design i'm gonna be coming out with a whole review of this because i see a lot of pros and a lot of cons with this thing overall i love the design that's what i'm gonna tell you right now and i also wanted to say that i just feel so bloated more so than normal because i've been drinking so much water like apparently this is one liter i have not actually measured this um myself so i'm kind of just going off of what people and the website say so one of these is a liter and i've been drinking a so many well not so many probably like two to three about three liters is a gallon so i've been drinking a lot more water because of this um it's cool because it has like the time stamps of like when you're supposed to be like drinking to track your time but i've never really had that issue with drinking water and stuff i could honestly drink this thing in like probably one go because i love water i've always liked water so i just wanted to say i feel a little bit more bloated because i think i've just been taking in a lot more water than i'm used to even though i do drink a lot of water by the way if you want to get this i'll link it down below i honestly just saw it as an advertisement on instagram and i was like oh that's a cute design so and it wasn't that much money and there was free shipping so i got it that leads me on to the pictures talking about bloating and stuff uh nothing really like looks different but i know you guys like to see this and i like doing it just to see you know the progress or regression you know like we'll just okay let's move on so on the left is alex last week and on the right is alex this week that's the front view and then this is a side view honestly it really does look the same but i feel like very normal in my body like i'm starting to get a lot more comfortable and here are the photos before i started working out alex on the left is pre-workout alex and alex on the right is current alex and then here is the side view of that and yeah so i hope you guys enjoy this video i hope you like that little story time about the chicken because i found that to be funny and we just couldn't stop talking about how panda express ran out of rice because i don't know it was just funny to us so anyway give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you guys so much for all of your support and i'll see you guys in my next video bye